to the world. Mm -hmm. uh, the, the artistic kind of tradition goes from Oprah Winfrey, uh, Moses Gunn, dating back to, mm -hmm. to even the 40s, mm -hmm. with Dr. Thomas E. Pogue at Tennessee State University taking students mm -hmm. all over the world. This tradition is a powerful mm -hmm. tradition, mm -hmm. and we stand on the shoulders of those giants who have come before us. Mm -hmm. So we, we keep pressing in, in those mm -hmm. areas, and we're going to be successful mm -hmm. at turning some things around here. Jeff, uh, now you've been involved in campus politics mm -hmm. for a long time, you know, student government president and et cetera, et cetera, which means that uh, you see some things in terms of the political process perhaps that other people might not uh, see. Uh, why don't you uh, take a few minutes, uh, these last few minutes, to uh, talk about what I'm almost sure that has impressed you uh, uh, about uh, Mr. Obama, about the, the, his presidency and, and, and what you see in terms of his presidency and what it might mean not only for African Americans but for, for the nation as a whole. Yeah, indeed. It's, it's, I'm, I'm honored to be alive in this era and to experience what I've experienced uh, in terms of politics. After campus politics, a lot of people tried to get me into the political mm -hmm. arena. So well, you ought to run for mm -hmm. council, or you ought to run for mayor. I said, no, no, that's not that. It takes a lot mm -hmm. to do that in, on a larger arena. Mm -hmm. And I'm not ruling out mm -hmm. that there might be a possibility down the line that mm -hmm. I might decide that after mm -hmm. I've done this artistic thing and, mm -hmm. and accomplished what I need to accomplish, I might get into it. But to be able to be alive in an era mm -hmm. Uh, where we see a President Barack Obama is an exciting thing, mm -hmm. and it's a blessing. There's a story that ran in the Associated Press a few years, a few months ago, mm -hmm. that talked about President Barack Obama inspiring black men. Mm -hmm. They did a profile on ART mm -hmm. and our theater, they did a profile on me, mm -hmm. and it's because back in uh, February mm -hmm. of 08 when he was running, Mm -hmm. I had an opportunity to travel to Ohio and do an event for him and his volunteers with Eddie George. Mm -hmm. And we went there and after the event, they said, well, President Obama's speaking at Ohio State tomorrow and you know, we appreciate what you guys did. Would you like to meet him? And we were like, mm -hmm. are you kidding me? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so mm -hmm. we went, we got into a room and it was a room full of politicians mm -hmm. and everybody was, hi, how are you? I'm representative, <laughs> you know, all of that. And then the one guy walks in the room who is totally not a politician mm -hmm. at all. He, he walks through the door and just says, man, I didn't know it'd be so much snow up here. Mm -hmm. And it's Barack Obama. <laughs> and we were like, wow. So he came over, he spent time, he, he was late, it was a blizzard up there, but he spent time with everybody in the room. I got an opportunity to talk to him mm -hmm. for a couple of minutes, uh, take a picture with him, mm -hmm. uh, just really get to know one-on-one -on -one mm -hmm. for just a couple of minutes. Mm -hmm the energy and spirit of, of the uh, gentleman. And mm -hmm. it was a very, very enlightening experience. Mm -hmm. I told him what we were doing in Tennessee. Mm -hmm. He said, keep doing that because what we need is people like you to do mm -hmm. one, their small part all over the place. Mm -hmm. And that mm -hmm. can change, it can change mm -hmm. the world. Mm -hmm. And that inspired me. I came back, that was February. We came back mm -hmm. and the next month found a building mm -hmm. to start working on mm -hmm. for the theater. Mm -hmm. So I think that his energy is infectious. I'm mm -hmm. excited. I'm honored mm -hmm. that I was able to, to mm -hmm. meet him. And people see the picture in the theater, they're like, is that a cardboard cutout mm -hmm. or is that really <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. But I hope to see him again. We'd like to have him into town and mm -hmm. to visit Amon Ra. But I think it's, um, it's inspiring mm -hmm. because his model was a little bit mm -hmm. helps out. Small people putting mm -hmm. their energies together mm -hmm. can cause change. And it's the African proverb, mm -hmm. when spider webs unite, they mm -hmm. can tie up the lion. Mm -hmm. So that's what we did with our program, getting mm -hmm. people to buy into just a person being on a roof and helping them get down, mm -hmm. helping people to come and to see their culture and to be mm -hmm. proud of it, and then to help in greater humanity. Mm -hmm. It just takes all of us doing a little mm -hmm. bit to make something big mm -hmm. happen. And it, it was very inspirational, and I think the same thing, that, and, and I've had an opportunity to uh, talk to just many uh, people since the time of his election, and the same thing, I always ask the same question, what's your story yeah. in reference to this? And everybody say the same thing, that it never would have had, they never thought it would happen, and they've been so inspired, and now they want to do some greater things. That's and, right. And I think that that's what you've demonstrated here, that you've done a lot of good things, Jeff, but uh, as they say in, in, in television and radio and and theater, the best is what? Yet to come. Yet to and come, we certainly indeed. certainly appreciate you. We've got about half a minute, but uh, have you got any kind of statement that you'd like to make over the last uh, 10 or 15 seconds before we call it a day? Well, Doc, I'll just say that I'm honored to sit here 
because you've been a giant and very much a model for all of us. And I appreciate you for what you're doing. Mm -hmm. And it's, it goes into the continuing motif mm -hmm. that uh, if each one of us stands where we are and shines our light, then mm -hmm. others can join around in that. Very good. And you're certainly doing that. And, and let me uh, thank our audience and encourage them to tune in again next week for another informative edition of Congress. Thank you and good morning.